Hello boys and girls, it's Mr. Steven from the virtual team. And in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to cook one of my favorite breakfast meals, which is an omelet. I'm also gonna be teaching you how to make my own version of a homemade salsa, which goes really well with the omelet. Keep in mind that in the video, I will not be showing you how to chop these vegetables. So if you do plan on making this food, please find help from an adult or from your supervisor to help you chop the vegetables so you can cook this meal. Thank you for coming by and I hope you enjoy. So we're gonna start by putting a quarter of an onion and three tomatoes into a pot of boiling water. The point of this is to make them soft for the salsa. Then we're going to fry a jalapeno. Once the tomato and onion get soft, we're going to put them into a blender. We are also going to add some cilantro to the salsa. For the spice, we're gonna add the jalapeno that we fried and four chile de arbol. For some extra flavor, we are going to add a small spoon of minced garlic. We're also going to add a very small amount of salt to give the salsa flavor. And we're going to pour just a little bit of juice from the boiling fruits and vegetables. So we're going to close it and we're going to blend it for about 30 seconds to a minute. This is sped up. And now I'm just going to pour the salsa into a bowl. To start cooking the omelet, we are going to crack some eggs into a bowl. I use four eggs, it might be less or it might be more for you, but I usually use four because that's the amount that I like to eat. Then once they're all cracked, we're going to stir them up, make them nice and even. And after that, we are going to add some flavor. So I'm going to start with pepper and a little bit of salt. Some people like to add garlic salt as well, but I am not a fan. Then I'm going to add some olive oil to a pan and get it nice and heated up. And once it's hot, we're going to start adding vegetables. So we got spinach, tomatoes, bell peppers, mushrooms, onions, and we're going to stir. We're going to stir the vegetables in the pan so they can cook up a little bit so they're not so crunchy in the omelet. And I'm going to add some pepper and some salt for more flavor. Once the vegetables are cooked to your liking, you can add the egg into the pan and you're just gonna let it sit until the edges cook. And once they do, you'll bring the edge in and you'll let the rest of the egg liquid pour into the open spot. So you're just going to keep repeating the process of bringing the corners in and letting the egg liquid go to the outside. And now is the trickiest part. You need to make sure that the egg can slide freely in the pan, just like this. And if it does, you're gonna go for a little flip. Bam, just like that. So once the egg's flipped, we're gonna add some cheese. I use the Mexican style blended cheese, and we're just gonna add it to the top, and we're gonna let it melt. Once it's melted, we're gonna take the spatula and we're gonna flip half of the omelet over itself just like that. Now I'm going to put the omelet on the plate and I'm going to add some avocado to my omelet. You don't have to, but I am a fan of avocado, so I will do that. I'm using a spoon to scoop the avocado out. And now I'm going to add the salsa that we made earlier to the top of the omelet. That is all. This is the finished omelet. Thank you for watching, and if you do end up cooking it, make sure to send it to this email.